esteemed dignitaries we kindly request your presence on the stage for this momentous occasion esteemed dignitaries we kindly request your presence on the stage for this momentous occasion welcome 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 esteemed dignitaries honored guests faculty members students and music enthusiasts a warm and harmonious welcome to this international music workshop a course of indian music organized by department of music kalai kaveri college of fine arts Our gathering here today is a celebration of diversity, a symphony of cultures and talents converging under the universal language of music. We have come together bound by our shared passion for the art of music. Before we commence this workshop, let us begin with the soulful melody on the Creator, who is the beginning of knowledge. wisdom arts and love i invite the students of music department to lead us in the prayer song aruli reiva nyanathin mudalva anbal enil vande thangidava aruli reiva nyanathin mudalva anbal enil vande for that beautiful invocation lighting of the lamp is a time honored tradition this act holds deep symbolic significance representing the dispelling of darkness and the illumination of knowledge to light the lamp may i now request right reverend dr c chandra sekran bishop csi trichy tanjo dices Reverend Dieter, Director, Basel Mission, Germany. Reverend Father Antoine Vicar General Catholic Diocese of Trichy 
Moira Rosina Doreen, a guest from Germany to light the lamp. Basantran, third BA Opal, Kalai Kaveri College. Good afternoon, everybody. There is a Polish saying, guest at home is... There you go. Guest at home is God at home. Today, as there are 36 Germans who have come to our college, I can proudly say that God himself is visiting our college. Am I not right? It gives me immense pleasure to welcome all the 36 German friends to this music workshop on behalf of the chairman of our college, the Most Reverend Dr. Aroke Raj, President of the College Committee, Reverend Father L. Antoine, Principal Dr. P. Nadrajan, staff and students of Kalei Kaveri College of Fine Arts. It is actually the Bishop, Right Reverend Dr. D. Chandrasegran, who a month ago requested me to arrange for this workshop. It is indeed a great pleasure to heed to his request as the group would be from Germany. So I welcome Bishop, Right Reverend Dr. D. Chandrasegran, the Director, Reverend Dieter, who has come from Germany, Reverend Solomon Benjamin, EMS Unit Head, India and East Asia, Mr. Schlusser, the Choir Master, Reverend Father L. Antwan, the Vicar General of Trichy Diocese, Reverend Father Suse Alangaram, Rector St. Augustine Seminary, Reverend Father Ramesh, Professor, St. Paul's Seminary. Reverend Father Deepan, Director, Kaveri Communication Center. And Dr. Paul Dayabaran, Principal of Bishop Heber College. Hearty welcome to you all. <laughs> Way back, our founder, Reverend Monsignor S.M. George, used to take the troop from our college to the European countries like Switzerland, Germany, France, Austria, UK, Canada, Sweden, Belgium, and Italy. But today, the Germans have come to our college, which doubles our joy. Dear German friends, you have not only come to a fine arts college, but to a temple of arts, which promotes human values besides teaching the art forms. Our college feels highly honored by your visit. Hearty welcome to you all. God bless you. Thank you, Father, for your warm words of welcome. Our chief guests for today are individuals who have not only achieved remarkable feats in their respective fields, but have also tirelessly contributed to the betterment of a community and beyond. In recognition of their outstanding achievements and dedications, we would like to honor them with a token of our appreciation. This memento serves as a symbol of our gratitude and admiration for your remarkable journey. May I request Reverend Father Anduan, Vicar General, Catholic Diocese of Trichy, to honor Right Reverend Dr. D. Chandrasekharan, Bishop, CSI Trichy Tanjavu Diocese, with a gift. May I 
request Reverend Father Sose Alangaram, Rector Trichy Dices, to honor Right Reverend Dr. C. Chandra Shagaran with a memento. May I request Father Louis Brito, Secretary, Kalekapuri College of Fine Arts, to honor Reverend Dieter, Director, Basel Mission, Germany, with a gift. May I request Reverend Father Deepan, Director, Kavri Communications, to honor Reverend Dieter with a memento. May I now request Dr. Uma Mageshwari, Associate Professor, Department of Vocal, to honor Reverend Solomon Benjamin, EMS Unit Head, India and East Asia, with a gift. I request Dr. P. Nadrajan, Principal, Kalekavari College of Fine Arts, to honor him with the memento. May I request Professor Mohti, Department of Mridangam, to honor Mr. Yugen Uwe Shushla, choir conductor with a gift. May I now request our beloved principal, Dr. P. Nadrajan, to honor Mr. Yugen with a memento. May I request Dr. Agnes Shermali, Head, Department of Violin, to honor Dr. Paul Dayabaran, Principal, Bishop Hibber College, with a gift. May I now request our Principal, Dr. P. Natarajan, to honor Dr. Paul Dayabaran with a memento. I now request all 34 international participants of the workshop to come on stage as we call out your names. I request Father Ramesh, Professor, St. Paul Seminary, Trichy to call out the names. May I also request Dr. P. Nadrajan, Principal, Kalekavari College, to recognize the participants with the bouquet. May I invite Reverend Father Louis Brito, Secretary, Kalekavari College, to extend our token of appreciation to the international participants of the workshop with the shield. Also, before you speak in uh, the Naman of of the Daise, his drawing is my uh, land lawyer, Hein Faxu Gurus and Asus will come in Kalekavari as his intubian selba in Pastra Thulagi Promet to have. Essling is in his next white phone, tubing in and as soon as start. Okay. Also, uh, we'll come in. Uh, Benedict Wilhelm Walsner. Benedict Wilhelm. What is what is that with those present? Yeah. Okay. Then the fish, Adina Olivia. Adina Chalete Shrole Adin Fak Abdirayit Suforget Emilia Sophie Elena Dan Eric Eric Ferdinand Ulrich Then Elena Luisa Jan Philip 
Then Katrina Cholete. Lena Sophie. Lika. Then Lucas Hosman Wilhelm. Magdalene Constance. Mirjam Romana Elizabeth Marie Emilia Berta Agusti Then Katrina Yako Friedman Yako Friedman then Yulia, then Karim, Moira Rosina, Anna Carolina, Nancy, Then Niels Becker, Isho Fahle Sindagye, Abhisheman Fagasin, come, Emilia, Emilia, Isha Bishon, Emilia, come. Also, we saw each and saw the site in Kalikavari and in Trichy. Thank you. Thank you all. Yeah. 
unbroken musical traditions in the world it has a rich tradition that originated in south asia and now can be found in all corners of the world indian classical music can be classified into ancient period medieval period and modern period hindustani music and carnatic music are the two main genres of classical music rabindra sangeet that is songs of rabindranath tagore is also considered important since it partially incorporates elements of classical music apart from the other genres of music hindustani music is the classical music of north india amar kushru systematizing some aspects of hindustani music and also introducing several ragas inventing the musical instruments such as sitar and tabla Hindustani music consists of four major forms or styles such as Drupad, Khyal, Tharana and semi-classical Tumri. Rabindra Sangeet, Music of Bengal Rabindra Sangeet has been an integral part of the culture of Bengal for over a century and is also practiced in Bangladesh. Carnatic music of southern India is one of the oldest and most complex forms of classical music in India. Shruti, melody and rhythm are the three important elements of Carnatic music. Uniqueness of Carnatic music. Carnatic music with its more homogeneous Indian tradition is known for its more structured and formalic method relying on complex yet orderly and uniform systems for the classification of ragas and talas and themes. The main emphasis in Carnatic music is on vocal music. Most compositions are written to be sung and even when played on instruments, they are meant to be performed in Gaiki style. Lyrics in Carnatic music are largely devotional. Many songs emphasize love or the concept of sublimation of human emotions for union with the divine. Gamakas, which means ornamentation or oxalation of swaras, is the major aspect of Carnatic music that is a distinguishing factor from other musical genres. There are many musical forms in Carnatic music. They are classified into Abhyasaganam and Sabhaganam. Abhyasaganam is the musical forms for practice exercise such as Sarali Varisai, Jande Varisai, etc. Sabhaganam is the musical form for concerts such as Varnam, Kriti, etc. Sarali Varisai, this is the first exercise in learning Carnatic music. Sari Gama Padadisa Sani Dapa Magarisa Jante Varisai. Jante means twin in which each swara is sung twice. 
ಸ ಸರಿ ರಿ ಗ ಘ ಮ ಮ ಪ ಪ ದ ದ ನಿ ನಿ ಸ ಸ ಸ ಸ ನಿ ನಿ ದ ದ ಪ ಪ ಮ ಮ ಗ ಗ ರಿ ರಿ ಸ ಸ ಗೀತಂ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲೆಸ್ಟ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕಲ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಈಚ್ ಸ್ವರಂ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಾಹಿತ್ಯ ಮ ಪ ದ ಸ ಸ ರಿ ರಿ ಸ ದ ಪ ಮ ಪ ಶ್ರೀ ಗಣನಾದ ಸಿಂಧೂರವರ್ಣ ವರ್ಣಂ ದಿಸ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಆಸ್ ದಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಐಟಮ್ ಇನ್ ಕಾನ್ಸರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಲಿಂಕ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಅಭ್ಯಾಸ ಗಾನಂ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸಭಾ ಗಾನಂ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ವಿಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಅದರ್ ಫ್ಯೂ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕಲ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ದ ಲೈವ್ ಕಾನ್ಸರ್ಟ್ ಸಾನಿ ಸದನಿ ಪಾಮ ಪ ಗ ಮ ಪದನಿ ಪಾದನಿ ಸರಿ ಸನಿ ದ ಪದನಿ ಸಾಮಿ ಕರ್ನಾಟಿಕ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕ್ ಜನರಲಿ ಇನ್ವಾಲ್ವ್ಸ್ ಅ ವೆರೈಟಿ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯೂಸಿಕಲ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟ್ರೂಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ the instruments are classified into drone instruments string instruments percussion instruments and wind instruments let's have a short overview of important instruments in carnatic music violin the violin has been imbibed into carnatic music nearly 200 years ago it is believed that Balaswami Dikshida introduced the violin to Indian Carnatic music with the help of other great patrons of music. The Carnatic violin is played sitting cross-legged and is held between the left collarbone near the shoulder and the chin. The violin is such an integral part of Carnatic classical music today and it has replaced the veena as an accompanying instrument even more recently. Gradually it got extended to solo performance as well. Veena the queen of instruments the veena is india's national instrument its origin can be traced to india's vedic period and to the ancient yal a stringed instrument similar to the grecian harp veena is revered in indian culture by its inclusion in the iconography of saraswati the hindu goddess of arts and learning it is a long necked pear shaped wooden lute and has 24 frets four melody strings and three drone strings Veena was used as an accompanying instrument in the olden days for vocal concerts and gradually violin replaced it in the later trends. Mridangam, a percussion instrument. The mridangam is a percussion instrument of ancient origin. It is the primary rhythmic accompaniment in a Carnatic music ensemble. Gatam. The gatam is one of the most ancient percussion instruments of India. It is a clay pot with narrow mouth. From the mouth it slants towards to form a ridge made mainly of clay baked with brass or copper fillings with a small amount of iron fillings the pitch of gatam varies according to its size ganjira the ganjira is a frame drum percussion instrument similar to the western tambourine which is used primarily in the concerts of carnatic music as a supporting instrument for the mridangam Kanjira consists of a circular frame made of the wood of jackfruit tree between 7 and 9 inches in width and 2 to 4 inches in depth. It is covered on one side with a drum head made of monitor lizard skin while the other side is left open. Morsing. The morsing similar to the jew's harp is used in the Carnatic music. The instrument consists of a metal ring in the shape of a horse shoe with two parallel forks which form the frame. and a metal tongue in the middle between the forks fixed to the ring at one end and free to vibrate at the other tawal a tawal is a barrel shaped percussion instrument from tamil nadu widely used in other southern states of tamil nadu and sri lanka nadaswaram the nadaswaram is a double reed wind instrument used as a traditional classical instrument in south india and sri lanka flute Flute is a wind instrument and produces sound when the player's air flows across an opening. The Indian flutes are made of bamboo and are keyless. Comparison between Carnatic music and Western music. Shruti pitch. 
In Carnatic music, singers play with Tambura Shruti in which Sa and Pa are taken as Adar Shruti which acts as the foundation. In Western music, the singers and instrumentalists play according to the chords in which the chords are set for a group of notes. For example, in C major scales melody, the first chord C, fourth chord F and fifth chord G act as the principal chords. Generally, in Carnatic music, male singers sing in scales ranging from 1 to 1 and a half Shruti, which is C to C sharp, and the singing range for female singers ranges from 5 to 5 and a half Shruti, which is G to G sharp. Instruments like Vinay is tuned to the Shruti of 3 or E scale, violin and Nadashwaram are played in 2 and a half or D sharp. The singers can adjust the Shruti according to their vocal agility. Whereas in Western music, there is no fixed chord. They change the chords according to the melody and the singers or instrumentalists perform in the pitch to which the song was originally composed. Carnatic music is always performed in a single melody. Whereas in Western music, three to four melodies are performed together at a time intervals to give out a harmony. In Carnatic musical concert, the performance is guided by the primary artist who is accompanied with other instruments. On the other hand, in Western music, every artist receives their own parts and importance. Every instrument gains its own unique part in concert. In Carnatic music, there is no special conductor. The artists themselves conduct the performance by following the rhythm with their hands or feet. In case of Western music, every concert has a conductor who guides the artist in rhythm and dynamics. The basic principle of Carnatic music is Shruti, Tharam and Bhavam. In Western music, they are termed as pitch, rhythm and expression. On the basis of Shruti, there are seven swaras in Carnatic music, which are Sa, Ri, Ga, Ma, Pa, Da and Ni. Noting the pitch on a paper is called note. For Americans, a note is written and a pitch is a sound. And the notes are A, B, C, D, E, F and G. There are 12 swarasthanas in Carnatic music, which are the 12 notes in Western music. In a Carnatic raga, only the swara of that specific ragam can be used and there are separate ragas with accident notes in it. But in western scales, the artists are free to use any accident notes in their compositions. In Carnatic music, there are 72 parent ragas and the Janya ragas derived from the parent ragams show different expressions. For example, Audava ragas with 5 notes Shadava ragas with six notes, etc. In Western music, we have two important scales and they are the major and minor scales. The ragas of Carnatic music are the scales in Western music. When Western music and Carnatic music are compared, the Western scale equivalent to the Carnatic ragas are found as follows. Raga Shankara Baranam is equivalent to major scale. Raga Nadabhairavi is equivalent to natural minor scale. Raga Kiravani is equivalent to harmonic minor scale. Raga Mohanam is equivalent to pentatonic major scale. Raga Hindolam is equivalent to pentatonic minor scale. Raga Karahara Priya is equivalent to Dorian scale. Raha Hari Kamboji is equivalent to Mixilidian scale. Carnatic music has a set of seven thalas called Sapta thalas, which is the rhythm. Also, they are divided into five jadis to give out 35 thalas. And there are also concepts of 175 thalams and 108 thalas, in which Chatushra Jadi Thrupada Thalam, also known as Adi Thalam, Chatushra Jadi Rupaka Thalam, and Chapu Thalams are widely used. While in Western music, the timing signatures will be 4x4 four four or common timing, 2x4 or cut common timing and other rhythms like 3x4, 6x8 etc.
When the thalams or the rhythms in Western and Carnatic music are compared, the following can be found to be equivalent. The Tisra Gati in Carnatic music which follows the pattern of Thakita, Thakita, Thakita is the same as one triplet, two triplet, three triplet in Western music. The Chatushra Gati in Carnatic music which follows the pattern of Thakatimi is the same as one Yanda in Western music. In Western music, the conversion of straight timing to swing when it comes to Carnatic music, it is Chatushra Nadai to Tisra Nadai. In Carnatic music, soulful notation is used. That is, the artists directly see the notations of swarams and follow it. In Western music, the artists are given the staff notations. In Carnatic music, each and every note is embellished and sung. Gamaka means not only the shake but also the manipulation of the note in a manner resulting in a musical effect. In Western music, there is no concept of Gamaka but there is a similar technique like grace notes, trill, vibrato, etc. A Carnatic music performance is embellished by singing Raga Alapana and Manodharma Sangeetam. This is similar to the concept of improvisation in Western music. Composers Carnatic music was enhanced by the contribution of Purandra Dasar, who is also known as the Sangeeta Pidamahar, Muthu Thandavar, Mari Mutta Pillai and Arunachala Kavirayar, who are famously known as the Trinity of Tamil music. Muthu Swami Dikshida, Diyaharajar and Syama Sastri are proudly known as the Music Trinity. Western music was enriched by the famous composers like Ludwig van Beethoven, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart, Johann Sebastian Bach, Richard Wagner and others. The division or angams of Carnatic music are Pallavi, Anupallavi, Charanam, Chittaiswaram, Muktaiswaram, Madhyamakala Sahitya. The divisions of Western music are verse, pre-chorus, chorus, stanza, etc. The musical forms of Carnatic music are in two categories. The musical forms for exercise and the musical forms for concerts. Whereas the musical forms or structure of Western music are opera, sonata, symphony, concerto and chamber quatrat which are done in monothematic, binary, ternary and rondo forms. In Carnatic music performance, Singing one specific raga in different shrutis is a format. When it comes to Western music, for example, C major scale is ragam shankarabharanam in all the shrutis. But it becomes different majors in Western music. In Western music, the singers shift their scales while singing a melody which is not allowed in Carnatic music. Carnatic artists perform a full concert in one single shruti. Sa
ಸದಗರ ಮೂದಲ ಇಳುತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಅಗರ ಮೂದನ ಕೇಳುತ್ತಿಲ್ಲ ಪದ 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 ಸರಿ ಸರಿ ಗ ಪದ ಸರಿ ಗ ಸರಿ ಗರಿ ಸರಿ ಸದ ರಿ ಸದ ಪದ ಪದ ಸರಿ ಸದ ಪಗ ರಿ ಸದ ಪಗ ರಿ ಸರಿ ಗ ಪದ ಅಗರ ಮೂದನ ಸರಿ ಗರಿ ಸದ ಸರಿ ಗರಿ ಗ ಪಗ ಗ ಪದ ಪದ ಸದ ದ ಸರಿ ಸರಿ ಗರಿ ಗರಿ ಸದ ಪರಿ ಸದ ಪಗ ಸರಿ ಗ ಪದ ಅಗರ ಮೂದಲ ಿರಲಾ ಇರ ಉದರ ನಾಗಿರಲಾ ನಗರ 
Nakmal Gansa Haslish Dunk, Guru Alawunsa Freunde, as a Saishan, giving our guns applause to Allah Lloyd. As a side for wounds, Liba Freunde, aus Esslingen, aus Stuttgart zu sagen, ich könnte auch die Frage ansehen, wollte etwas austauschen oder fragen nach indischer Musik oder einfach. Kultur, über unsere Kultur, habt ihr jemanden Fragen oder Ergänzung? Geht es auch. Ja? Natürlich gibt es auch Chorleiter. Ja? Ihr könnt auch einfach beginnen zu sagen. Ja. Einfach Comment. So, Tambigle, Tangigle, Ide Ungola Karanerum. Nengel, uh, yeah, Tamil also. So, friends, you can also raise questions and ask them questions. It's a time to exchange our ideas, okay, Western music or Carnatic music, uh, or even ask some questions regarding the culture and what they understand, like that. Okay. 
Cuba Gibbs. Ya. Damit alle hören können, gell? So, we spoke about Shruti and Rhythm, but are there also like uh, dynamical differences in Indian music? Because in, in Germany and in Western music, we make a lot of dynamical differences with piano and forte. These are the, the terms we used, but are there also some like in Indian music, a part of playing with drums or without drums? You want me to answer? Okay. So there is always dynamic also in Indian music. Okay. As as Western music also. Okay. We also use a, this is a traditional um, instrument that we use in Indian music. There are also uh, instruments used by ordinary people also, like drums. Okay. Then tapu. Uh, that's a uh, uh, that is. Uh, people who use also traditionally also. This is Kant's typical um, Indian instrument, so to say. Okay. Uh, uh, we have, sorry, I had forgot to use the, there are some folk instruments. Okay, this is typical Carnatic instruments. We have uh, classic instruments. We also folk instruments. Yeah. You were asking about the dynamics, right? about the dynamics. Uh, for Carnatic music, we don't specially have any notation for the dynamics, but we learn it from our teachers. We use the dynamics according to the meaning of the lyrics. Wherever there is some kind of uh, divinity or some kind of uh, emotional things, when it comes, we just lower our tone. But when it comes to some kind of bravery or active parts, we raise our sound, and that is what the dynamics we use in Carnatic music. I felt a lot of dynamic, really. It felt very dynamic, but it's different, I, I, I know. Uh, my question is, where does this music take place? Is it in church? Is it at home? Is it in concert halls? Do you go to the pub and play? You play in the villages, on the wherever. So where do you play this typical music? In case of Indian music, it is taking part right from the birth till the death. When a baby is born, we just sing Nalabai, and when a person is not uh, no more at the funeral, we play Parai, that is different kind of music. In case of Carnatic music, it is usually taking places in temples, where uh, we have uh, so many rituals we follow in the temples. So in that places, we sing uh, Carnatic music. Also, there are separate concerts for Carnatic. Separate concerts will be held by great singers and instrumentalists. Uh, so as we see here, like this, some other concerts will take place in so many places of India, but mostly it is related with uh, religion. And so many places, uh, we, uh, we see these concerts mostly in temples. Also, there are sabhas specially for this Carnatic music. Sabhas, that uh, like... Fit uh, Samulung, like that. Yeah. Ah, yes, uh, such places are there for Carnatic music also. There we perform these kind of arts. Um, it seemed to me that women were playing certain instruments and men were playing other instruments. Is that prescribed or was that a coincidence that women played one sort and men the other? It is not a coincidence. Mostly boys are interested in rhythm, I think. There are also girls who are playing Mridangam here. And you can see vocal singers, also female singers and male singers are singing. Uh, while in also all the other instruments, you can see male and female singers and artists playing. Only in case of Mridangam and Gatam, the percussion instruments, you see men's play because they are more interested to it. And there are also scientific things that female are not allowed to play those percussion instruments. But nowadays, there are also female who are playing Mridangam. Not kind of frog, eh? uh, so you talked about Carnatic music. Does this Carnatic mean that this music from the state of Karnataka, or what does this mean, Carnatic? <laughs> Since he has landed in Karnataka, he is asking whether the music, why it is Carnatic. Since it comes from Karnataka, I like that. Why it is called Carnatic? Okay, teachers, why it is called Carnatic music? Is it from Karnataka, state Karnataka? 
so this carnatic music is a very old form of music that is why it is named karnataka carnatic music also the word karna means learning from the teacher so it is mostly heard by uh, heard and learned so that is why it is named carnatic music karna means learning from the teacher it is very ancient that is why it is named carnatic it is not about the place it is about the meaning thank you so one thing is clear one thing is clear it's not it does not come from karnataka this is ancient music <laughs> okay okay tamil kuda kekala ninga carnatic music is nothing but tamil music you have the seven swaras no that seven swaras from seven uh, uh, notes that that means also the parrot and goat then uh, please say the belsia the seven swaras in carnatic music represent seven different animals like peacock buffalo and each and every note is depicted to some kind of animal it this is, is also ancient a tamil music is so known as carnatic music Uh, in uh, in the beginning it was called tamil music tamil isai then it was transformed into carnatic music which became the music of south india Thank you all for your mind-blowing performance. Father Brito, the secretary of the <coughs> Kalikavari Fine Arts College, and our friend, our respected VG, Father Anduvan, Rector Father um, Susai Alangaram, and the principal, the members of the faculty, students at the outset, I would like to congratulate you for the wonderful performance that you made the today evening. and we were so excited and our friends from germany were so excited moved by the way you sang and you gave them the reception they received the welcome and all they enjoyed very much and after the every i mean after the every presentation my friend director was shouting how many of you heard his whistle sound whistle adichar avaru because he was so <laughs> excited so we, we are very grateful to Uh, kalai kaveri really i praise god it is a great gift to the church because it's not simply you know m- m- music you know they are promoting the human values in the society which is very need of the world particularly in indian context we are promoting love and uh, unity and human values that is very important and behalf of the trichi tanjavur diocese of the church of south india i bring greetings to the very um, esteemed institution kalai kaveri for helping us to have this program indian music is known not only for its beautiful melodies and deep emotions 
it not only sounds wonderful but also helps people to connect and feel things deeply it unites us comforts those who are in need and shares profound ideas that awaken our inner creativity at this juncture i would like to thank kale kaveri fine arts college trichy for helping ems that is a, a evangelical mission for solidarity they are working nearly 100 countries so they have a friend has come and uh, reverend benjamin salomon is the coordinator who has brought the team here and i am also very grateful to uh, reverend christopher he can also stand just for a while he is the man he is representing the church of south india synod and who has planned everything very meticulously and he has brought the team today here and despite their busy schedule the kalikaveri has helped us to help our choir to experience what is indian music this shows their dedication promoting cross cultural understanding and artistic growth dear friends actually our friends from ems you know eslingen they are uh, they are basically they are musicians and uh, they are singers so they have come to visit uh, different parts of the south indian churches to present some concert only for that reason they have come here and we it is they are also interested in knowing what is indian music so when uh, our brother ravan benjamin salomon when he was asking about the kalai kaveri immediately we could contact father brito and he is a man uh, is immediately very promptly he responded and i am also very grateful to dr payal the paul dayabaran the uh, principal of bishop eber college who coordinated the entire program i just called only uh, secretary father father brito that's all the remaining part was played by uh, the principal of bishop heber college the this special opportunity we let, uh, let the ems youth choir discover the many sides of indian music helping them understand its wonderful appeal i am confident that with the guidance of kale kaveri college of fine and uh, fine arts they will navigate this exploration smoothly even though indian music is vast and complex indian music is not just something that you hear or understand on the surface but it's meant to be felt and embraced fully its tunes and rhythms can take you to a peaceful place and the experience stay with you as the ems youth choir embarks on this journey i wish them a meaningful and eye opening time may you find inspiration learn about our culture and connect deeply with indian music timelessly beauty your participation shows how music can bring cultures together and unite people across the border music is a great powerful gift of god that transcend everything you know color creed caste and everything and it brings people together there's a wonderful uh, gift god has given and we have to celebrate it celebrate for the well being of human kind so i take this opportunity once again to thank um our secretary sir and other responsible people our respected vg uh, father anduvan and uh, the principal and i'm very happy that someone is here to make our german friends to feel at home that is none other than father uh, ramesh <laughs> he was here and uh, i think uh, uh, because he spoke in uh, german many many of our german friends i mean they all feel at home as though they are in germany so we are very grateful to father ja ramesh also thank you very much once again for all your uh, support and uh, extending your hospitality and reception may god bless you all and uh, my best wishes to the ems youth choir uh, in trichy town may god bless you thank you good evening everyone today is a blessed day i extend my hearty wishes combined with warmest gratitude to all the participants who had come all the way from germany to attend this workshop out of your love for our indian music i would like to extend my most sincere thanks to almighty god for his blessings my sincere thanks to all the esteemed dignitaries for gracing this occasion with their presence today on the successful completion of the international workshop I thank Reverend Father S Louis Brito Secretary of Kalai Kaveri College for his guidance 
ஐ தேங்க் டாக்டர் பி நடராஜன் பிரின்சிபல் கலை காவிரி காலேஜ் ஃபார் ஹிஸ் கான்ஸ்டன்ட் சப்போர்ட் சின்ஸ் த ரிசிப்ட் ஆஃப் த இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் ஆஃப் த அரைவல் ஆஃப் தேர்ட்டி சிக்ஸ் ஜெர்மன்ஸ் டு அவர் காலேஜ் கைடட் பை த பிரின்சிபல் கெஸ்ட் அட் ஹோம் இஸ் காட் அட் ஹோம் ரெவரண்ட் ஃபாதர் அண்ட் பெலவட் பிரின்சிபல் have constantly worked round the clock to make this event a grand success my sincere thanks to both of them my sincere thanks to our faculty members of the department of music dr uma maheshwari dr venkat lakshmi mr st murthy dr banumathi dr agnes sharmili dr rajesh babu mr prakash dr prem kumar dr prasanna kumari mr adisaya parlogaraj mr balamurgan and mr sandosh for their cooperation i thank mr tamil selvan for his technical support in preparing the presentation i thank dr linda assistant professor of english for her voice over in the presentation i thank mr gnana prakasam campus manager for his support I also thank Mr. Raj Kamal, Mr. Jeroen and other non-teaching staff for their constant support and help. My sincere gratitude to faculty members of the Department of Bharat Natyam and Department of Languages for their support and encouragement. I thank dear students of the Music Department for their wonderful performance and for their help in the successful completion of this workshop i thank each and every one if left unmentioned for their help thank you for this opportunity tinai tunai nanri seenum panai tunaiya kolvar payan therivar nan நன்றி 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 தேங்க்யூ வாட் அ வெல்கம் வாட் கிரேட் மியூசிக் அண்ட் I think we are all blessed by this afternoon. Thank you, thank you very much from our German side. And I talked a little bit to this honorary people here and we said, "Oh, it might be a good idea if there would be a group coming to Germany and uh, do a concert tour." And actually our choir master He has a great program in the city of Esslingen and in a big church all every other Saturday so your music would put uh, would really fit perfectly there so we would love to extend an invitation an invitation so you guys get along well i can see so organize something get something going and you are very well welcome in germany thank you very much and we also would like you to invite to come to the concert tomorrow evening thank you very much thank you dieter for your invitation to come to germany that is why we are learning german in our college <laughs> and by the way by the way this evening we are going to perform the dance items at the bishop hever college yes we have two departments one is music and another is dance you saw only music this this workshop is a music workshop there is also a dance department in our college and those team the students they are going to perform this evening enjoy janagana manahati nayaka jaya he bharat bhagya vidata पंजाब सिंध गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उत्कल बंगा विंध्य हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्छल जलदी तरंगा 
तव शुभ नामे जाहे तव शुभ आशीष माहे गाहे तव जय गाता जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विदाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे